let's let's do this all right here we have a this is where's my paper where's the paperwork for this this lenovo angeline i don't need the paperwork i just need to like what's the model of it All right, so in the middle of this video, we have another computer we're gonna work on very quickly. It's a Lenovo IdeaPad L340. Correct. All right. So on the bottom, to get this guy apart, this is normally in here. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 screws. Remove that one first. After you remove that, you're able to remove the DVD ROM drive. Then you remove all of them. All of the screws are the same size, which is surprising, but they're all the same size. And then after that, you can grab this in here and gently lift and it should come open. All right, once we're inside, we see we got a one terabyte hard drive over here. We have our battery. We have, is this non, is it? So we have non-soldered memory. So in theory, you could upgrade this. We have our cooler and not much else. Uh, as far as like repairability of this, Mm, let's say we're we're at like a like an eight nine this is this is actually pretty good very simple to get apart you don't have to remember where screws necessarily go and getting to the battery the battery is one two three four five screws to get the battery out get the hard drive out is let me see here we got three two screws and then those two screws come out, uh, then this lifts. And all right, so take it down a little bit. This battery screw needs to come out to get this out. Both of them do. So that's a little bit aggravating, but it helps keep the cost down just a little bit. So that's out. Now we're gonna get a new hard drive put in there. Our new one terabyte Samsung SSD. Actually, before we do this, we're gonna actually try and do a clone on this too. So, that's how you'd replace that, but before we do that, we're gonna attempt to do a data recovery on this, or a, a data transfer, and then we will dive into getting the SSD put in here if we can't. All right, so let's go ahead and do a clone on this laptop before I have to hop on this call. All right, so this is gonna be this is gonna be close because this hard drive that's in here has a lot of bad sectors, and generally clones don't like it when you have a lot of bad sectors. So we'll see. Hopefully. Hopefully it'll work. If not, then what I'm gonna end up doing is I'm gonna end up installing Windows 10 just on to this SSD. And then after I install it, I'll just pull up this drive and just move over whatever I can. Yeah. So while that runs, I have to get on a conference call. I'll be right back. All right, so this is that, this, the drive that I'm replacing is so hot. It's wild. Hey, thanks for checking out this video. If you like these videos, make sure you hit the like button. If you wanna see more videos like this, hit the subscribe button. It really, really helps the channel. Now on this laptop, if this clone did not work, I love how this thing started up while I was working on it. You know, before I do this, let me do the smart thing. Make sure this thing actually loads into Windows before I put all the screws back in. All right, let's get the rest of these screws put in here. And then get this thing back to these folks. Just can't believe how slow that, that clone was. It just took so long. Yeah, I just finished. And this, this drive is only a few years old. Hey, thanks for watching that video. If you liked that video, make sure you hit the like button. 
If you want to see more videos like this, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I stream daily on Twitch at twitch.tv slash specvengeance. And uh, yeah, if you want to learn more about my services, check out BradentonPCRepair.com. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.